Hi, this is Peter from Stanford University, and I'm going to talk to you about the REVS Digital Library website, which is a collaboration between Stanford University Libraries and the REVS Institute in Naples, Florida. This website has hundreds of thousands of archived, digitized images about automotive history, and you can search or browse the images using the search box here or using the various kinds of metadata that we have associated with the images. So, for example, I can search all the images that are associated with Ford by clicking on that link and finding a result set. Choosing one of the images will take me to the detail page where I can see all the specific metadata for this image. I can also view the image in higher detail by choosing the zoom view. Once I go to the zoom view, I have additional controls over here to move closer into the image and view extra detail. If you think you know something about this image or you notice something that you think is wrong here, there's a flag correction to this item link here. If you click that link, you can enter in a comment and click this button. And that comment will go into the system for a curator to review. If you're to create an account and log in, and there's another screencast that talks about that, we know who you are and will be more easily able to contact you and let you know how the correction went. You'll notice that some of the metadata is hyperlinked. These hyperlinks would take you directly to a result set with that other piece of metadata. So if I clicked on Jaguar, I would go to a page that listed all the cars that were tagged with Jaguar. All of the images in the REVS Digital Library are also in the Stanford Digital Repository. And what this means is that by looking at any image, you will have a citation page with a permanent, distinct URL you can use to cite the data. Click on that link and you'll come to the permanent URL page in SDR. Here you'll have all the metadata and the image itself, and this URL up here is the permanent URL. The images are also organized by collection at the REVS Institute. So if I were to click on the Collections tab up here, I would get all the collections from the REVS Institute that have been digitized and placed into the ar digital archive, and I can choose one of them. On the collection page, I can easily browse through the images in the collection and then choose to view one. If you were to sign in, you'd have more actions available to you on this page, such as annotations, favorites, and galleries. You should check out the screencast to learn more about those. Take your time to explore, and we hope you come back often to see the new images that we're adding to the website. We also hope you sign up for an account and use the other features. Let us know about any corrections we need to make. Thanks.